Okay, so it's basically so you actually it further back. So I can help. So it's it's a little bit drier. And you can see it's you can blend the colours into each other. It's almost a bit like the cross blending. Can you see it's mixing on the page? Okay, so that's now let's go position three. So this is nice and loose. Nice movement, can you see? Okay. Two. Okay, we're going to do position three, underhand, flat hand. Now look at that. It almost gives you like a kind of a palette, a uh, hogsy kind of feel. Eh? Can you see? Like an eh? Yeah. So you get very lovely movement with this technique. Hogsy is going to work really nicely with us. Position one. So it's a very front position one. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm going to do position three. Yeah. Um, I'm further away from the brush. Mm -hmm. So I'm holding it very further away. And I can also work it on its side. So it gives me nice, look there if I push and pull it on its side, it's nice. Mm -hmm. So underhand, same thing, underhand. Mm -hmm. Look at that nice movement that I can get there. Lovely, huh? Yeah. Very nice movement. Then, um, so this you're going to do for very organic, very modern, will work very nicely with modern paintings, with landscapes, you know. Same. Nice, eh? Mm. And get very nice movement. So this is scribbling. Then we're going to do pointillism. 